Alex from Alio.com and we're here with this condition. So if you want to start by telling us your name, your age, and what you play in the band. My name is... Sorry, I got distracted. <laughs> My name is Nathan and I sing and play guitar in the band. How old am I? I'm 27. Actually, I just turned. So, how long have you known all the guys in your band and how did you all know? Um, I've known them for about three or four years. Met them when I was in school. Just, actually, me and Mike are tall guitarists, and uh, our old drummer used to work at American Music. Yeah. And we met and started, started jamming. And, and, and when did you know you really wanted to pursue your dream of music? Um, know, like uh, when I was in high school, I, I started getting involved in music a lot. So. I don't know, I just kind of fell into it. Yeah. I didn't really like make a conscious decision. Just kind of, kind of, yeah, just went with it. Yeah. And how'd you come up with your band name this time? The band name is actually from a song by Jack's Mannequin, Dark Blue. Do you know? Yeah. It's a song that's like, what could, what could you possibly expect under this condition? Yeah. That's right. Yeah. I know, it's a good song. <laughs> Camera girl likes it. <laughs> Flora. Flora? Flora. Flora. <laughs> Pleasure. <laughs> what has been a wow moment for your band so far? What has been a wow moment? Um, it's not going on over there. That was a lot of action. Um, let's see. See, one of the, anytime we play a show, especially like our home shows in New York and stuff, we have a lot of our fans and friends that come out that know the words. Anytime that I can like stop singing and just hear everyone singing yeah. the words back, it's really like. Awesome. I really like it. Uh, it means a lot. It feels really good. Yeah. And um, can you impersonate a band member? Can I impersonate? I'm probably a bad person to impersonate. <laughs> but, um, um, Devin? I can impersonate Devin, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> Devin's really silly. Devin's our drummer. He's silly. Yeah, whenever he gets really frustrated or something, we like to pick on him. We pick on him more than one. Whenever he gets really frustrated or something, he gets like all defensive and he turns on this like this like this gay hand like he's talking, which is really funny. I love it. He's always like, well, actually, you see, he does this like little this little like diva hand thing, and he puckers his lips. It's really cute. You should check it out. Song we never like really released, we just kind of give it away for free called Take Take Take, and that's probably my favorite lyrics because it's just like really personal. So, I mean, you have to check it out and you can tell me if you like it, maybe you won't like it. <laughs> <laughs> and, um, why is it this condition show something that you can kind of say? Um, I'm good, it's, it's you kind of build up a good like family of friends and fans become friends and everything and I don't know, there's a lot of love. Yeah. When I go to those shows I feel like I'm home, it's comfortable. You know, there's like I try to preach as much as possible, uh, you know, kind of this love only thing. There's like not really any place you hate or any of that kind of stuff. At least not in my life and hopefully not in other people's life. Especially not spreading it. So if you come to this condition show you're definitely gonna feel the love from us and hopefully from everyone around you. And um What's a quote that you live by or a saying that gets you through each day and keeps you going? Um, a lot of things actually. But uh, one in particular that, I've, that my dad told me when I was young in high school that I've like repeated over and over is basically, uh, the harder you work, the luckier you get. I think it's a really good, it's kind of like, um, it's kind of self Work hard and you get lucky officially. Like, live by that. So I try to work hard. And that's what you gotta do. You gotta, if, you don't, if you want something, you gotta work at it. Yeah. You're only gonna get out what you put in. Yeah. Do you have anything that's to really say That's kind of like really like grown up for me, right? <laughs> I should have been like, live free or die, motherfucker. Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, rock and roll. Oh, that's the license plate. 
Yeah, that's the New Hampshire State Bono. Are you from New Hampshire? Yeah. That's really funny. I didn't even realize, right? That's like your thing. It's like, that's really brutal. I'm really proud of you guys for that. Your state, whatever. Your forefathers, Benjamin Franklin. I don't know. Is that your name there? Is he from? I don't know. Come on. You ain't from there. You should know this. New England area. New England. Rock and roll. Anyways, what? Do you have anything to say to your fans? Um. If you ever come to a show or you're reading this or listen, watching this whenever, and you never heard of us, listen and then come to a show and then say hi to any one of us because we're all really nice people and nothing, we, we don't like anything more than actually interacting with people on a one to one level. So come do that, it's fun. And what website can we check out your band? If you go to thiscondition.net, you can get to everything on there. There's links to our Facebook, uh, everything, tour dates. Twitter, Tumblr, all that fun stuff. We're on every network. Or you can just Google it. Google it. Alright, that's it. Thank you. Thank you.